Fetal kick counts are a simple way to monitor a baby's health during pregnancy. By tracking how often the baby moves, we can catch signs of distress early. Moms usually begin around 28 weeks or sooner if the pregnancy is high risk. These counts are easy to do at home and they can literally be life-saving. The most common method is count to 10. Mom counts baby's movements until she reaches 10. This usually takes less than two hours. Movements include kicks, rolls, jabs, or flips. Hiccups may feel rhythmic, but don't count toward the total. Some providers prefer the Cardiff method, where moms record how many kicks they feel in one hour. Others may suggest hourly trend tracking, especially if there are concerns. If the baby isn't moving much, change position, eat something, and try again. Still fewer than 10 movements? The patient should call their provider immediately. Nurses teach the mom how to do kick counts, give her tools to track it, and emphasize why it matters. A calm explanation helps reduce anxiety and builds trust. Not all moms will feel confident doing kick counts. Some may be too busy, anxious, or unsure if they're doing it right. It's our job to normalize it, break it down, and help them feel empowered. Kick counts are more than a routine task. They can detect early signs of fetal hypoxia and help prevent adverse outcomes when followed properly. Changes in movement often come before changes in heart rate. Early detection saves lives.